GCSE Geography, Managing the UK's Water. In the UK, places with a good supply of water are not the same as the places with the highest demand. This is really represented in the UK average annual rainfall map compared to the UK population density map. The north and west of the UK have high areas of rainfall, areas of water surplus. The south east and midlands have high population densities, so a higher demand for water. Overall, we know that the demand for water in the UK is increasing. Since 1975, the household water volume has gone up by 75%, with more dishwashers and washing machine appliances. Also, the increasing population, expected to increase by over 6 million by 2040, means more water is needed. Population densities are also changing. There are plans to build lots of new homes in the south east where there is already a water deficit. Polluted or low quality water reduces the amount available to use, hence it is one major problem. Nitrates and phosphates from crop fertilisers are washed into rivers and groundwater through a process called eutrophication. Pause to take note of this. Solution Water transfers. To solve demand and supply issues, transfer water from areas of surplus to areas of deficit. For example, in Wales, an area of water surplus, to Birmingham, an area of water deficit. However, water transfers can cause a variance of issues too. Dams and aqueducts are too expensive to build. They can affect wildlife that live in rivers. And they might, there might be political issues. For example, people might not want their water transferred to another area. Thank you for watching this video and for more videos on GCSE Religious Studies, English, French and Geography, feel free to subscribe.